they will vary. Um, as you saw from the credits, I was the visual effects lead and character effects lead. Abel was our lighting and render master. He was amazing at it. Um, many of the people that work on this film are here in the audience with us today, and um, we just want to say uh, thank you to all of them and to their family members, my wife in particular, <laughs> uh, for sacrificing their time and uh, allowing us to be able to pursue our goal of making professionals who can go out into the industry and make films with the best of them. And thank you. some parts weren't there yet. Yes, this was a work in progress. Uh, I would say two to three weeks. Yes? The audio will be redone in 5.1 surround sound. This is just for the presentation tonight. How long have you been working on the project? Um, Aaron Bristow and a couple others of us started the idea uh, last fall, uh, fall 2009, and uh, it began full production swing uh, soon after the last animated short, Darn Little Devil, was completed, so about a year in full production. Any other questions? Comments? So now you're going to submit this to a bunch of uh, um, we, we are going to actually be submitting it to student um, film festivals and the Student Academy Awards. Uh, so at the present time, that kind of precludes us from publicly distributing it because of some of the limitations that are structured by some of those competitions. But eventually, it will be available, I'm sure. <laughs> Yes, how long have you spent consistently on campus during the making of <laughs> My wife said it was really funny when her friends thought she was joking with it. She only saw me for a week in the last, or an hour in the last two weeks. So, that's how long I've been consistently at the campus working on this film. And a lot of others. And several others. Actually, I think what we're going to do is rename the senior projects from the Holiday Inn. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. It's no holiday. <laughs> The idea here is that they've put in, you don't, for those who are clients or just here administrators, uh, even faculty, you know, we know what our students are doing, they're committed, and regardless of which project they've been on, they've spent an enormous amount of hours on campus in that project room or in the labs working. I, I, I think a lot of people won't know this, but to get this project, and it wasn't just this project, it was... Uh, seniors working on projects, digital media, many of them, we actually changed policy at UVU. We, they, you know, at the beginning of the semester, we couldn't stay here overnight. We could not work past 9 p.m. They were threatened with being arrested. And, and, uh, and I was sleeping there. And it was working with, working with risk management at the school, the IT group, um, our dean, who was very supportive, Administrators up there, we actually changed the policy so that they could stay in the lab and get the work done that they had to get done. So, yeah. 
So Trudy, I think we should make sure everyone gets a round of applause. Yes, please.